Okay, good morning. Welcome to the ninth commentary video from the Riot uh, Ozone game from 2012 ECC. Uh, this morning we're going to take a look at um, a, a spread out concept. So this isn't a um, specific uh, commentary, uh, critical or not critical on a play. Here I think we are doing what we want to do and the cuts that are happening are occurring uh, the way we want them to occur. And so nobody's doing anything wrong. Uh, but I'm questioning whether we want this sort of thing to happen, especially after looking at how effective Fury is with their handlers. Uh, when their handlers get the disc in the middle of the field and how well they leave the middle of the field open for their cutters. So near the beginning of this point, uh, right when the disc gets centered to the handler the first time, I'm pretty sure it's Alyssa handling, you're going to see Nora and Kirsten. Kirsten's going to go deep, Nora's going to come around and go under. What happens here is when Nora's coming around like this, she serves to cut off this, this cutting lane here. So she uh, prevents Alyssa from throwing to, to Kirsten deep. Now, in this specific case, there's already a defender there, so that throw is probably not going to go up. But this cut, uh, I'm not sure about because I, I, want this, I want these throwing lanes open. Later in the point, you're going to see the disc come uh, swing to the middle, I think from Dom, and I think it's HM with, with the disc here. When she gets the disc, uh, Nora is deep in the field and comes around like this. Uh, so what happens is, is she's sort of occupying all this space the whole time, and we get kind of a th short swing on stall two or three. So take a look at that, and then uh, I'll come back and talk about it a little more. Okay, so as I said, uh, this isn't something where I think we're doing anything wrong. I think this is how we want the offense to be working right now. But uh, again, after watching the, the two Fury films and how good they are when their handlers get the disc in the middle of the field and they have so much room to throw to, to cutters, I wonder if we're doing the right thing by having these cuts come into these throwing lanes short. So what I'd like to see here, I think a better... Uh, cut here is just for her to come out of the way for a little while, three or four seconds, leaving this space here. When the disc swings to the middle of the field here, she's moving, uh, Nora's moving across the field. I'd like her to just get out because we've got Jill on one side, someone on the other side. Maybe they can come around like this into the wide open space rather than a, a short swing on stall two or three. So again, just conceptual, just something to think about. In this point, we work the disc up the field in 10 passes to score. It um, tends kind of a lot. It's sort of what I have in my mind. If we can make teams throw 10 passes to score, we're doing a good job. I'm trying to figure out how, a couple ways we might get the disc or downfield more quickly and be more efficient. And I like, I really, really like what I see from Fury on how they leave that middle of the field open for big throws to come into. So just some, just concept, just something to think about. Thanks for watching.